political stalwart, 78-year-old Joe Sereman. In his hand, the book written by Helen Ziller, Not Without a Fight. He speaks quite fondly of the women he competed against in the DA's leadership race in 2007 and struggles to reconcile their interactions with some public sentiments that Zilla is racist. And I'm not passing judgment on her. Now, I don't know what the findings will be, but the public has already judged her. She's racist. I know another side of this person racist which does not click with racism. The party is yet to set a date for the disciplinary hearing, but the panel that will hear the matter has been appointed. All three members boast law qualifications. They must go through that process in a fair, equitable, just way. DA leader Musi Mamani has expressed his unhappiness over Zilla's tweet. He is reportedly trying to push her out of the Western Cape Premier seat. However, Zillas still enjoy some support in the DA. And Seremani says the expected row post the verdict won't crack the party. And if Zilla is found guilty of racism by the DA, then appropriately they must mete out the punishment, whatever verdict they have. Zilla has apologized but evidently doesn't regret sending the tweet which remains on her timeline. Aldrin St. Pierre, SABC News.